kind of game now, eSports, a local group not only helping kids get better at the video games they love, but also teaching them skills they can use off the computer. Your Audrey Dickerber introduces us to Gnome Gamers. They treat it like any other sport. Not every kid likes sports. Not every kid wants to be part of a team sport. So we take that same aspect and we build it into video games. Changing the outlook of what playing video games could mean. One of the things we are trying to combat is that esports are bad or video games are bad. While video games have a negative connotation sometimes for some people, however, we're taking that and turning it into a positive environment getting kids to come in here, play with one another, interact with one another. It's more than just playing a game. They're creating a community. Community is more important to me than the video games at this point. I like getting a place for the kids to come in, act, uh, be themselves, um, play video games. That's what they like. It's a modern way to socialize and even increase kids STEM skills by improving hand eye coordination and more. I've definitely met some of my closest friends here, so that makes it fun, but I also just like playing video games. While creating healthy competition here at home. It's like you can goof off, but at the same time, try your hardest to get better. And across the country. Once a year, we do take about 30 to 40 kids down to Orlando for what we call the North American Finals. This year, we took 33 kids down to Orlando, and we actually won first place in Apex Legends. A place to learn and a place to be challenged behind the screen and away from it. It takes a bit to get used to, but it's worth it because I have a lot of fun here. In Martinez, Audrey Dick Herbert, on your side. And some great skills are